previous videos in this series, we've looked at some of the issues, problems and challenges that arise when it comes to installing recessed lights into ceilings that have been constructed using eye joists. Now, the most common question that seems to have come back is, why is this the electrician's responsibility? We haven't chosen the system of construction. We haven't decided to fit eye joists. Why is it suddenly our responsibility to make sure that the light fittings that we're installing have been tested against this system of construction? Well, the answer to that really is that we don't operate in isolation. When we install a recessed light into a ceiling, we contribute to a system of construction that's been put in place to make sure that not just the plasterboard that goes on the ceiling, but actually that entire construction will last for a certain amount of time should a fire break out. Now, often that question of why is this our responsibility can spring from a concern or even a fear of getting it wrong in an installation situation. So how do we go about making sure that we get it right? Well, the starting point is knowledge. You need to make sure that you understand what system of eye joist has been installed in that property. It may have been manufactured by Staircraft or Weyerhaeuser or Metzawood or Boyce Cascade or some others. So that's the starting point. You need to ask that question. What eye joist have been installed? Then you need to check that the lighting manufacturer has test certification that proves that that light fitting has been tested and approved for use against that particular brand of eye joist. If it does, then you're okay to go ahead with the installation. Now, the good news is that some manufacturers have got well ahead of the curve and have already completed testing that prove that their light fittings can be used against certain brands of eye joist. And in fact, JCC have completed the widest range of tests of their fittings against various brands of eye joists. And all you've got to do is head over to their website where you'll be able to find a list that shows which eye joists their fittings have been tested against and approved for use. This includes the V50 range of fire rated fittings and also the fire guard range. And that really is a critical point because it's not a case of one eye joist fits all. You have to prove that the light fitting is safe for use against a specific brand of eye joist. So yes, it is another thing for electricians to think about. It is another responsibility for us to shoulder. However, we are a responsible trade. And when you're working with great brands who take the situation seriously, like JCC, then that responsibility needn't be a heavy one.